Fire Team Osiris. Over the last 72 hours, five colonies have experienced identical events. Massive destruction, forerunner in origin. And Dr. Catherine Elizabeth Halsey has managed to contact us. She claims to have information on these attacks. Halsey is currently in Covenant custody on the surface of Kamchata. Your mission is to insert behind enemy lines, retrieve Halsey, and bring her back to Infinity. Be advised, Dr. Halsey is accompanied by Covenant Supreme Leader Jewel Dama. If you have the opportunity... Understood, Commander. Good luck, Spartan Lock. Infinity out. Cracking gear online. Affirmative. Say, before we make this jump, anybody want to say a few words? I figure if God can hear how scared I am, so can everyone else. Lock, you buying the first drink when we're done? You ask, you buy. <laughs> Fire Team Osiris, the light is green. Xbox One Limited Edition Bundle. Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. This is Forgotten Camel, and this was the Halo cinematic trailer. I am very impressed, really. I mean, oh, oh. You know, this, this, it's trailers like these that make me really excited for you know, series, it just makes me really excited for Halo. I mean, some of you may not know, but I never really cared about the multiplayer. All I care about is the story, and this makes me want to see the whole story. I, I don't care about anything else. Th they put so much work into this. I mean, oh my goodness. I uh, I haven't seen a uh, free fall to be honest since Halo 2. Oh God, it's not recording. Oh wait, it is okay. Never mind. Anyway, I haven't seen the free fall since Halo 2. Uh, I I just don't know what to say. I'm a lost words to this. To this trailer I I'm pretty excited I mean there, there are honestly already a lot of trailers and ads here <sighs> but I love the cinematic cinematic trailer that's I mean it, it broke me to pieces I learned a lot about the Halo series and uh, to be honest I was never really excited for Halo 5 Guardians I did pre-order it 
but I don't. I mean, a lot of you people are worried about the upcoming Halo game, but to be honest, I'm not worried. It, it might the multiplayer might be me meteor core, but if I know Microsoft and 343, they know how to make a story. So I think that we should get them the benefit of the doubt. Besides, I stopped caring about the multiplayer since Reach, and I'm a Halo 3 veteran, so I'd never really liked the Halo Reach multiplayer. Uh, anyway. Seriously, th this makes me want to watch it over again. I'm going to have to do a little breakdown a bit. So, obviously, Halsey and the... Prophet Elite is involved again. And we all knew that. You played the Halo 4 side campaign, didn't you? Oh, you probably didn't because you hated Halo 4. I did. I didn't hate it, but I definitely played it and I know a lot. Fire Team Osiris. Over the last 72 hours, the guy from Halo 4 is returning, you know, that captain, or I think he's a colonel now. But of course, Buck is back. If he were any better, he'd be a Spartan, right? So, what I did notice, now this is my favorite part, actually, so I'm going to show you this. They're free falling. Just like that. That's just so amazing. It, it feels like the Avengers, really. I mean, some of you might complain about that, but this is really freaking awesome. If they're all free falling and touching down in the sky, destroying everything they see. And look, look at the right there, you can see. That's just amazing. It's amazing. Contact. One of the things that I had to say that I noticed, one of the guys, uh, wait, I think I went too far. No? There it is. You see that? The minute that guy lands on the ground, he punches the ground and it causes a shock wave. That, that's why I'm interested in seeing. That's pretty amazing. And, of course, you get the... You pretty much get the rip off to my, uh, you know, rip runs off of the ghost. And that's, this scene is, I'm actually a lot worse at this scene. And there he goes again, he's doing that shock wave. Now that would be interesting, you know, you saw that, right? He was using his jetpack to uh, throttle him to tear off that grunt, off that ghost. I wonder if they're going to add that there. That would be awesome. And the Didac. Well, I don't think he's... I'm not sure if he's returning or not, but... You can see all that. Ah, I'm at the pause, excuse me. Just look at this scene. So, honestly, I don't know, because I haven't really uh, researched this that much. I only checked it out because I saw it in my email, but... This scene, I really like. I want it as my wallpaper. I honestly do. Also, um, I'm actually wondering, because some of you probably already know this than I do, but... Probably, uh, the, you're not going to be going solo anymore. Kind of like in Reach. Uh, but you're probably not going to be going solo. So it's going to... 
I, I, I don't know how it's going to be, but I really, really, really am excited for the campaign. Okay, I can't really say anything else. I can't really pick off anything about it because, you know, I'm not that good at it. But I say this is really nice. By the way, uh, I was trying to make a video a couple days ago, The Gamer's Opinion. It's not ready yet. I've been really busy with school. And I, I just got this right now. Uh, so. This. I really had to show this to you. This is pretty amazing. I, no joke. It's. I can't. I mean. I, it's. I'm really excited. Anyway. Uh, sooner or later I'm going to show up a ga gamer's opinion. By the way, I was playing the Black Ops 3 beta and uh, they ended it on the 3rd or 2nd, I believe. So it's not available. The beta isn't available anymore. I guess they figure out all the problems to it. I'm pretty glad that the... I uh, did that first because it was pretty bumpy the beta. Uh, so I think that's the reason why they decided to show a beta because they were having some sort of t trouble with online system and they had to get it tested out. So they, apparently they figured out the problem so they shut down the beta and it's going to show up on November 6th. Uh, Fallout I believe Fallout 4 is coming out November 10th. Halo... Halo 5. I can't remember when that's coming out. Probably October or December. I got... Well, I'm looking it up at too many things. But anyway, this was the Halo 5 open cinematic. It was amazing. I could watch it over and over again. They really need to make a movie, to be honest. This is just too amazing. I mean, everybody's talked about it. They gotta make a movie. They just gotta do it. So, anyway. This was Forgotten Camel. Uh, thank you for watching. And thank you uh, for still being around. Uh, without further ado, good day.